Listen, this is just a strange thing. I, I went back and forth on which story I wanted to use for this, but I ended up going this one. It's a little out of my realm. That's why I went this direction. But uh, a guy, Blake Martinez, right? A former NFL linebacker who was a fourth round pick in 2017 by the Green Bay Packers, right? Mm-hmm. You're in the fourth round of the NFL. Like this dude, legit, right? Big boy, 6'3", 225, moves like a champion. He has a company, it's called Blake's Breaks, right? And he retired from the NFL because Blake's Breaks is selling Pokemon cards on a uh, this site. I, I, there's a bunch of sites, but Whatnot's the big one. I've never heard of this, but for mm-hmm. some of you guys that do do trading cards and buy stuff, Whatnot's like a, the, the app, right, to go on and like trade your cards. So he's been doing Pokemon cards, NFL linebacker, right? And he's thinking of me, right? He made last year alone 11.7 million dollars in one year of selling these Pokemon cards. Right. And he does all types of stuff. Like he sells them when he pulls them out of packs. Cause obviously he's got some, uh, NFL, uh, scuttle. So like, you know, he's got some backing to be able to buy these things and do like these things. Probably he also a YouTube does, like, channel where he yep. does, you know, on yep. openings and unboxings and stuff. Which so these, has openings, revenue. these openings he does, he does them. And he says like, Hey, you can like, uh, like throw in bread as like a gamble to see if you can get a good card out of them, which mm-hmm. they said he like set up. And also a bunch of other people are complaining that they never received the cards they paid for, blah, blah, blah. Mm. So, of course, they go down and they shut it down. These nerds have his his website shut down, right? He's no longer allowed to be on this premier thing of whatnot. I'm going to uh, I'm gonna ask you guys. He's a big meathead, right? He's a football player. Guess what college this guy went to. It's not uh, going to surprise you. Tell me he's a gator. Tell me he's a gator. Nope. Wrong. You too. Seminole? Sentinel? Nope. Damn, is he a hurricane? Harvard, Harvard, very close. Burn, we're hot. Liam, he's hot. What do you got? DC and Yale. No, nope, very close. Stanford educator. Oh, Stanford. Uh, so of course, this big meathead figured out how to scam everyone. Like you yeah. look at him and you're like, I guarantee, you guys that jumped on his site were like, oh, it's a big meathead football player. He's a yeah. dummy. No, no, no. He graduated with a degree in finance from Stanford. Yeah. I was going to say he's University. an econ major at Stanford. <laughs> Yeah, hundred percent. Stuck around. Homeboy he he hurt his knee as a senior, so he hung around for that fifth year just to get the masters, and then realized yeah. like, oh, I don't actually have to battle Charizard, uh, uh, i.e., Aaron Donald or whoever's coming at me <laughs> right. to punch me in the right. face every day. Yeah. Like, I'm just yeah. gonna get out of here. And just... When I saw eleven point seven million dollars in one year, I was like, how is that possible? Then it came up That's that he tall. was a Stanford graduate. I was like, oh yeah, never mind. It makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he's sense. like, I'm done getting whacked by Quentin Nelson. I'm yeah. gonna sell post. Hundred percent. I'm top. tired of tackling Derrick Henry. He's a linebacker. Oh. I don't want Derrick Henry running into me no more. <laughs> yeah. Andrew Luck also Stanford grad. Is that? Yeah. Am I right there? Sure they is. Played yeah. together, right? Sure yeah, is. It sounds like the same yeah. time period. Uh, nah, Luck was in the league for a long time, but he he came out in 17. Luck probably graduated like 13, 14. Oh, long yeah. time. Uh, yeah, maybe right, maybe yeah. 11. Luck's already yeah, Christian yeah. McCaffrey then, right? Yes. 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 For sure. For sure. Yeah. 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 If what Christian McCaffrey think? tries to think, sell Liam? you some real estate in five years, I know. don't buy it. Yeah, I know yeah. you, and, you and Ian know some about cards. You're going to buy from this Stanford meathead or what? I mean, it, I don't know. I, just talk about hitting the genetic lottery. You know what I mean? Like right. he's an NFL player and everything. And then he's Freak. Ivy League educated. I mean, yeah, if I'm being honest, it's two things that I'm not really big on Pokemon, but I right. do like. Like there are trading cards that I like and everything, and right. but it is two things I like. You know what I mean? Like stuff yeah. like that, like nerd mm-hmm. stuff and football. So yeah, I would be like, why hey, would you buy from him? Hey, I like this guy. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. And you're thinking he's well known. Why would he rip you off if he's right. in the spotlight and everything? Yeah. Right. You know? yeah, he's, Those are things he's like he bread. has the money to buy the cards. Yeah. 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 Right. Right. Yeah, so I wouldn't like, expect to get ripped off by him if that's what you're <laughs> rich I would, I would trust him. Yes. Yeah. I was about to say the biggest. The biggest thing was like when people probably looked at it, even if you were into cards, like balls deep, mm, mm-hmm. that's probably not a great term, but <laughs> balls deep into cards. And you're like, you look this guy up, you want to know what's going on. You're like, Stanford educated, made it to the NFL. You're like, this dude's like, this is the Terminator. Why would he I must love buy this from him? too. Right. Like he left the NFL to do this. This must be a special, you know, the, the COVID really, um, even with like sports cards, like all of that stuff is, is all back. Came back. Huge. It all came back. All that collection stuff came back during COVID because people couldn't go do anything. So it became like. Yeah, it's a whole <laughs> shout, gimmick. It became a whole e- gimmick. Shout out E-Dub, 
uh, yeah. uh, a, a former guest of the show who loves his card trading and buying. I hope you didn't buy any from this bull, Ian. Yeah. Nice. Or if you did, at least hope he sent them to you. You know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hope you got or them. hopefully you could sue him because he's got the bread to pay out. Yeah, nice. yeah this, dude, sure. this dude. This dude lives in the uh, uh, in uh, Turks and Caicos now. You know what I sure mean? Enough. Like he's not coming back here for that lawsuit. I'm, dude, I'm sure his <laughs> I'm sure his refund policy is airtight. Like you zero. know what I mean? It's like zero, he knows Matt. what he's doing. Yeah, it's so, zero. <laughs> nice. All right, very. This dude's good. been gone. Good stuff. Very good. Uh, let's keep it moving.